in a division that is winnable, this is a great job. It checks all the boxes. Plus, he's got a built-in fan base that are Gator fans and Jacksonville Jaguars fans. I mean, they, they play the world's largest outdoor cocktail party in Jacksonville every single year. There is definitely a crossover Venn diagram where there are Gators fans that are definitely Jaguars fans. So there's a, there's a couple of wins here for Urban Meyer. Is there a guarantee he turned them into winners? No, but this is absolutely a credible risk to take for the Jaguars. I have no qualms about the Jaguars offering this job to Urban Meyer because, let's face it, the Jaguars have treaded in irrelevance for a long time, and they have a chance now to reset everything, and they're going to do so with a guy that has done his own resets before. There's no guarantee that a college coach with a lot of success walks into the NFL and has the success. We saw Nick Saban flame out relatively quickly, and that's Nick freaking Saban. We've seen Jim Harbaugh have immediate success, but then that wane and fizzle out as well, and now nobody wants him in the NFL. We have seen college coaches try to try to do it, Bobby Petrino, and fail miserably. So there are those examples. There's also Pete Carroll. And I know that Pete Carroll was an NFL coach before going to college, but he was not a successful head coach in the NFL and went to college and figured out the secret sauce, what worked for him, and helped create the dynasty the biggest reason they were a dynasty at usc well also their checkbooks were pretty deep they they paid well but pete carroll then comes to the nfl and is far more established and understands what it's going to take to win so it can work from the flip side as well matt rules first year in the nfl was a pretty good success The Panthers were better than a lot of people thought that they would be. Far more plucky, far more competitive, and that a lot of people around Carolina believe Matt Rule has the plan. So there's evidence that it can work. If you're the Jaguars, I think it's a calculated risk and one that you've got to take, and I applaud it. And there's no guarantee they turn into winners, but I will take my shot with a guy that has that reputation or at least that That resume, his reputation, let's face it, is a little shaky. But his resume is a winner and a builder of programs and turning things around and getting you to an elite status. I'll take my chances right now with Urban Meyer. So I like that hire for the Jaguars, even though there's no guarantee they turn him into winners.